Vanguard Fleet, Guardian Ship 723 is on approach. We received your beacon and we're ready to join the fight. Guardian Ship, this is Zavala. It's too late. The Hive have overrun Titan. I was wrong to bring us here. Commander, we're here to help. No! We've already lost too many Lightless Guardians to the Hive. We can't secure this moon. We have our light back. What? Impossible. Commander, if I may. Guardian, this is Deputy Commander Sloan. We have a counter-offensive to plan. To do that, we need to get this station up and running. There's a fleet to prep, guardians to arm, and a trove of intercepted Red Legion transmissions to decrypt. It's critical we gain access to the station's control center. That's where you come in. If the light really is with you, send the hive back to hell. And guardian, please, be careful. What was this place? The golden age cities of Titan were once the pride of humanity. We thought they were abandoned. But I was a fool to think the hive would not spread this far. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay, Sloan. We can see the control center. Copy that. Keep pushing forward. Commander, at this rate, we can start planning our counteroffensive. We'll be outside the city gates in no time. Hmm. If it were only that simple.
I shudder to think what spell the Hive were casting back there. We should talk to Eris Morn. She would know which Hive god they were communing with. No one has seen Eris, or Ikora, or Cade. Since the city fell. There's the control center. Clear the area so we can move in. the nest. Heading to the control center now. Well done. Sweep the perimeter and we'll move in on your signal.
alone, Commander? It's done. Copy that. Zabala and I are inbound. We're approaching the landing platform. Get up here and take a bow. I didn't dare believe. If the light can find its way back to you, then perhaps there is hope for us all. Our numbers will continue to dwindle. We can no longer protect ourselves, much less the survivors. And without the light, are we even guardians anymore? Commander. We won't last long with dead generators. Wave energy converters power this station, but thanks to the Hive, they're in need of attention. We can take care of it. Yes, I believe you can. Let's get started. There's a banner on the main floor. Give it a look, will you? This is a House of Judgment sigil. We used to work with a Fallen who flew this banner. Curious. Well, the Fallen seem to have put this up as a bit of a threat. I imagine you'll find lots of objects like this out there. Bit of a story to them. We both need some supplies to get going out here. See if you find a cache in one of the buildings nearby. We'll have to look for every opportunity. Keep your eyes peeled for more supplies in the wilds. Speaking of the wilds, there's a symbol on the wall of the church. Take a look. Devrim. Where did this symbol come from? I believe your city hunters must have put them here and there about the region as they scouted around. I think they meant it to mark something special. Or dangerous. Or both. Let's go check it out. The history of this region is fascinating. I believe tunnels and caves like the one you're in now stretch all across the EDZ. Who knows what's lurking down there? Be careful. snag the key code from that captain. I think I can open his supply cache. Good work. 
work down there, you two. Keep an eye out for other hidey holes and treasures like this one. But that's for another day. In the meantime, what say we get down to business? Come on back up to the church tower. I'm putting a kettle on now. Looking for something? Stay low and move quiet. All right, we're not out of this yet. Now that we've reached the control center, we still need to power up the place before we can take care of our fleet. Commander Zavala tells me you've volunteered. I'll run tactical. Shipwright Holiday here will provide tech support. It's a straightforward op. Get in, flip a switch, get out. <laughs> Sloan's got a way of making things sound easy, doesn't she? the fallen here no those vultures have been following us since we evacuated earth Amanda, the Hive have infected everything. Holiday, we gotta get you back in the air. We'll need ongoing aerial threat assessments to keep our perimeter secure. Oh, uh, yeah. You know my ship took a beating during the evacuation. I'll bump you to the front of the line for repairs once the lights are back on. Great. Great. See the wave energy converters from here. Sweet. Now just flip the switch and turn them on. Accessing systems now. Some of the pistons are moving, but we're still sitting in the dark. Something went wrong. Pistons must be jammed. Sorry, pal. But you're gonna have to go out there. Bring a workaround.
you hear that? Made it to the converter platforms. Okay. Get to the stalled pistons. See what's jamming them. Once they're all moving, we're in business. Oh yeah. I found the problem. The hive have gunked up the pistons. Then let's find a fix. First piston's good to go. We gave it a power scrubbing. That's great and all, but, uh, it's still pretty dark on this end. Sounds like you got more scrubbing to do, Guardian. Final piston is clear. Control center's still dark, so it's gotta be more than a piston problem. I have to get in futz with the circuit breakers. Try the central platform. Everything routes through there. Breaker is going to be around there somewhere. Find it and flip the switch. Just like I said. Yeah! Powered back! Exemplary work, everyone. But we still have to deal with these intercepted enemy transmissions. Holiday has detected an unusual amount of electricity being redirected into the arcology. Yep. Juice like that can only mean one thing. A network of CPUs. Powerful ones. Maybe powerful enough to decrypt that cabal signal we intercepted. Unfortunately, we don't know where the network might be located. So, you're gonna have to snoop around, not draw too much attention. Guardian. Securing this asset could turn the tide of this war with the Red Legion. Without, I don't know what comes next. <laughs> Looks like the Fallen were trying to break through those tiles. Saturn. Sounds like the Arcology's operating system is back online. I knew it. 
Keep an eye out for an OS access terminal. You can use it to pinpoint the CPU network. Over there, one of the access terminals we're looking for. The CPU network is deep in the maintenance levels. Amanda, is this what we're looking for? Bingo! That's the place. Okay, I've got the location. Let's find a way down. Looks like the hive dug a shortcut for us. Let's head down that hole in the ground. We're definitely in hive territory now. Indeed. Keep radio chatter to a minimum. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention.
there's no way the Hive didn't hear that alarm. We got the CPU, but we stirred up the entire Hive colony, and it's a long walk to the surface. Move it, Guardian. They're not gonna make it out of there, Commander. Guardian, can you make it to the center of the Arcology? We should be able to send someone to pick you up from there. Holiday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. This road leads to the center of the Arcology. We'll need a way out once we get there. I'm strapping in and about to take off. I'll be there ASAP. Amanda. Sir? Fly fast. Fly safe. Yes, sir. CPU back to control and decrypt these transmissions. Things may finally be looking up for us. They call it the Almighty, the crown jewel of the Red Legion and life's work of their leader, Dominus Gaul. Gaul has subjugated hundreds of worlds. Those that resisted no longer exist. You see, the Almighty annihilates stars. One survives Gaul's ambition. What he wants is the Traveler and its light. As for the Almighty, it's now pointed at our sun. In short, sir, the war's over and we've lost. our home under the protection of the Traveler. When our enemies attacked, we built a wall that stood for centuries. But now walls mean nothing. This enemy has taken our home, taken our light, and now they threaten our very existence. We're going all in on this 
Almighty. How long before the fleet's combat ready? Zavala, wait. If we wait, we die. But if we attack together, we can take back our home, our light, our hope. Or we die trying. Now, I need my fire team. I need Ikora and Cade. So much for nothing being here. Let's get to high ground so I can pin down Cade's location. Here we go. Tracking Cade's signal now. I think I'm getting something. Get over my head! Vex trap! Well, six. Vex trap? What is Cade getting us into this time? Something around here is blasting that signal into space. We find that something, we'll find Cade. There! The signal's coming from that wrecked ship! Whoa, you're not Cade. The Cade 6 is currently caught in a teleportation loop. He's over there. Whoop. Now he's over there. Whoop. He's moving? Well, that's complicated. I can help you. But I'm gonna be super unpleasant about it. I'm sorry. What? I have uploaded his new coordinates to you. Against my better judgment. Uh, oh. Okay. May I help you with anything else? Yeah. Are you okay? You sound a little... off. I am the Exodus Black's failsafe. Call me failsafe. I boosted the Cade 6s signal in hopes he would be rescued. And look, here you are. Oh, I see. She's just an AI. A malfunctioning AI. I heard that. At your service. Centaurs are supposed to be just giant icy rocks. How did all this happen? A robotic alien entity called the Vex have achieved 92.014% conversion of the Centaur Nessus. Cade! Someone there? Listen, don't ask me how this happened. I don't have time to explain what I don't have time to understand. Warning, the Vex will vaporize you.
so fail-safe, what exactly happened here? The Kane 6 attempted to manipulate the Vex portal system. He is now trapped in a non-linear loop. In my defense, I tried to warn him. He's like, not that smart. This is not going well. How long have you been here exactly? Long enough to see the Vex convert this entire planetoid, kill all living organisms, reformat molecules, and digitize brain waves for further study. It's a fascinating process. She sounds way too excited about that. I'm almost afraid to ask, but failsafe, what happened to the Exodus Black crew? Only my captain can access those memories. And he's super dead. The Cade 6 is just beyond that Vex gate. Please proceed. Won't we get stuck like Cade? Oh no, my judgment module is much more reliable than the Cade unit. We're through. We're okay. Of course. The Cade 6 is not far now. gonna stick. Kate? What have you- Stop, 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 stop. Look, look. Long story, and it may look like I don't know what I'm doing, but I do. Maybe not. Doesn't matter. Killing the power source at the origin point should break the loop and get me out of the portal system. Have you got that? Say you've got it. Say something. Fine, I'll say it. We got it, Kate. Now, how did you- Oh, my cotton socks! Did you not hear what I just said? I'm guessing this is why they don't like him leaving the tower. Failsafe, we're at your coordinates. Cade is stuck inside a Vex portal system. Can you help us find the power source so we can get him out? Oh yes. By locating the original Vex teleporter the Cade unit used, you can shut down the loop and free him. I can guide you there. Okay, so we find this Vex teleporter and shut it down. Easy. this stuff. It's called Radiolaria. You know, Vex mind fluid. Hmm. This stuff is organic. Seems the Vex are not pure robot.
could have possibly brought Cade to Nessus? I know the answer. One, stop listening in on us. Two, what's the answer? He asked me not to tell anyone. Warning, Banks threat detected. They are blocking your path to the Cade unit's teleporter. You will have to eliminate them. Your wholesale destruction of the Vex would make me miss my captain and crew less. Did it? It did not. This is the Vex teleporter? Yes. The Cade 6 will want it. You should pick it up. Take that, you scrappy! I'm out, baby! Ouch! Woo! Cade, where are you? Hey! You did it! You got me out! Unit, you are near the remains of my reactor core. Welcome to the Exodus Black, where all your dreams come true. Uh, seems like you've met my new friends, Failsafe and her evil twin, Failsafe. Which is the evil one? If I had feelings, they would be hurt. Uh-oh. Fallon's got the Vex in a tizzy, and by tizzy, I mean murderous rampage. I'll hunker down in the Exodus Black. Here? But my hull is in 108 pieces. Decks 1 through 20 are buried, and my coolant system... <sighs> I am a mess. Oh, we know, Railsafe. We know. Intruder alert! It's me! It's... It's the Cade unit? False. I mean, true. But you are attracting large numbers of Fallen to my position. I was hoping the Fallen and Vex would finish each other off on Venus. But then you'd miss all the fun. Damn it! Feel safe to shoot at me! Then I advise you not get shot. 
That is a really big vex. Lord's down. Hold on, Pete. We're on our way. Uh, that's good to hear, because the Fallen just found us. Activating defensive shield. The Cade 6 must stand back. Hey, nice one, failsafe. The Fallen can't get to us now. That's, that's right, Phil. They, they can't. Right? Probably want to hustle. I think they just said something about ripping my beautiful horn off my face. My beautiful, beautiful horn. Intruder alert. And again, my elixir is pretty rusty. Uh, it's us. and drop something.
Hey, hey, down, down, down. So it's true. The light found its way back to you. Not that I'm jealous or nothing, but <laughs> take it easy out there, will you? You're making me look bad. What, may we ask, were you going to do with a Vex teleporter? Get up close and personal with go. put a bullet in his head, then maybe eat a sandwich. Gotta work out a few kinks first. Fun fact about the Vex tech, not as intuitive as you'd think. Cade, you can't do this alone. <clears throat> Hell, I can't. <sighs> Even if you manage to kill Gaul, when the Red Legion leave a system, defeat or victory, they leave nothing behind. The Cabal are bad guys who do bad things. Yes, I get it. I'm sorry, but I do not think you do. The Cabal literally leave nothing behind. They have a weapon that can destroy a star, and it is pointed directly at our sun. Hey, 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 easy, easy. You're gonna blow a bulb. Zavala has a plan. He needs you, Kate. Yes, well, Zavala always says he has a plan, but sometimes he just... Wait. Zavala said he needs me? As in, you heard those exact words coming out of Zavala's mouth? Yes, we did. Please tell me you recorded it. Well, did Akora at least hear it? Actually, Zavala lost her after the city fell. We don't know where she is. Io. Io, it's, it's where she'd go to look for answers. Hey, um, thanks. Oh, you are. 